watching the station covering all of the DMV. DC News Now continues. And we're in the 8 o'clock hour and it's still quite cold out there. Notice these temperatures right around 20 in Manassas and Culpeper. We're upper teens over towards Woodstock and Lorray. Also Martinsburg coming in at 19 degrees. We're low 20s in Frederick, upper 20s though over towards Hagerstown. Right around the 30 degree mark though in D.C. If you're wondering how much colder it is this morning compared to yesterday morning, well here's a look at that map. Many of us running at least 10 degrees colder, especially areas north and west of the district. We're noticing that for much of the I-81 corridor at this point, at least a 15 degree difference in Winchester, at least a 20 degree difference in Martinsburg and Frederick. So in those two areas, we are noticing that much colder air this morning. High pressures back out towards our west. We are seeing relatively calm conditions out there right now. Clear skies and also clear in terms of the radar. So no need for the umbrella out there today. And that dry pattern continues into tomorrow as well as Saturday. If you're trying to plan out the rest of your Thursday, though, we will see those clear skies persisting. Temperatures will vary into those low to mid 40s for much of the region later on this afternoon. But we are in for a warm up for the day tomorrow. We're back in the mid to upper 50s for much of the area for your Friday alongside the sunshine. So get outside and enjoy it. Tomorrow will be a great day for any of those outdoor plans you may have. Maybe if you're trying to pick up any of those uh, gifts for the holidays, Friday will be a nice day for that. If you can't do it Friday, Saturday will also be a nice day to do so as well as we'll see those 50s under a mix of sun and clouds. We'll see a bit more of the cloud cover Saturday compared to Friday because Saturday that's ahead of our next system. That next weather maker moves in Sunday. So it looks like Saturday the pick of the weekend for any of those plans that you may have. Sunday the better day to stay inside, maybe catch up on any of those holiday movies you may have missed over the years. We're looking at Sunday later on in the evening. That's when we could see those winds starting to pick up and also some steadier rain before eventually we start to notice those rain showers that are widespread on Sunday turn a bit more on the scattered side on Monday. Monday by the middle of the day we should start to notice those showers exiting but back over towards our extreme western zones out towards some of those higher elevations it could end as some snow showers back over towards western Maryland and parts of West Virginia. Aside from that this will be a mainly rain event with this system considering look at these high temperatures the next several days. Now after today which is below normal we're back in the 50s not only tomorrow but that extends all the way through Monday before then we fall back below normal for Tuesday and Wednesday. So behind the system for next Tuesday and Wednesday, we're looking at those temperatures much cooler, but it'll still be breezy next Tuesday. And with that, it's going to feel even colder. So heads up for next Tuesday for that. We're back in the mid 40s on Wednesday, mainly sunny that day. And then by next Thursday, still holding into the 40s. And at least we're still holding on to that sunshine as well. Shanika's back with the all important look at those roadways. What's the very latest?